To state the obvious, religion is a powerful presence in Colorado. It always has been, always will be. And not to get too metaphysical, but you know, religion can be used for fantastic reasons and purposes. But it could also be used negatively, when people use religion as a basis to discriminate against employees. In fact, we, we had someone in Denver who called us who had just been fired because the employer wanted every single one of his employees, I mean every one, to pray to the same God that the employer did. And that's religious discrimination. Religious discrimination affects all religions. Our firm has had cases where Jews have been discriminated against, Christians have been discriminated against, Muslims have been discriminated against. Unfortunately, if your employer believes so strongly in his or her religion, that employer sometimes will try to impose those beliefs on you, and that can be illegal. There are two types of religious discrimination. First, there's a situation where an employer hires or fires someone because of his or her religion. That's illegal under the Colorado Anti-Discrimination Act. There's also the situation where an employer either allows a hostile work environment towards a particular religion or harasses someone because of his or her religion. That's illegal also. These can include religious jokes, stereotypes based on religion, which we do see all the time, or even not allowing an individual to pray at a particular time. These are all potential examples of a hostile work environment based on religion. Previously, almost all victims of religious discrimination in Colorado would file their claims in federal court, because federal court allowed for much better damages than state court. Starting January 1st, 2015, that's going to change. And that's because an amendment to the Colorado Anti-Discrimination Act now provides for a whole set of additional remedies and damages. And I expect to see almost everyone file their claims now in state court instead of federal court.